Today I'm going to try something new. I've got my digital camera strapped to the bottom of my plane. I'm going to do like an aerial view movie as I go up. So I'll turn it on and take off. Take off here. I've never tried this before so I don't know how it's going to change the aerodynamics or if it's even going to work or the balance. Uh, if the plane gets too far away, I've got this device, hands-free binoculars, which I have never tested, but um, I just uh, duct taped binoculars to a baseball cap bill, and I've got a uh, rubber band. Put this on and then continue flying it. So we'll see how that goes. A bit crazy, I know, but uh, but fun. Anyway, we got to clear this curb here, and then it drops off. So as long as I clear this curb, I'm okay. I'm shooting between two trees here, so uh, it'll be interesting. And I've got a side wind. I should be taking off into the wind, but that would be taking off into the sun, and that's kind of harsh. So here we go. I never heard it make that sound before. doesn't have much power with just the engine. Sounds good. Now normally I would just tighten this hand tight, but uh, one theory I have is that it wasn't tight enough and the uh, propeller was actually slipping on the axle. So this time I'm going to use a little screwdriver here. You can slip it through the hole. You can give it, uh, torque it tight. Here's what it sounds like now. And I can definitely feel the pull. It's definitely got some power now. behind the tree and I couldn't figure out what it was doing so I couldn't fly it but that camera is definitely weighing it down so I don't know what happened it had trouble uh, getting some lift probably the extra weight um, the only damage I can see is that the uh, propeller is bent so I put a new propeller on it and the nose cone let's hear how it sounds <laughs> Yeah, the engine mount is bent, but um, it's got a lot of force, so hopefully um, two out of the four sides to the engine mount um, are cracked off, but as long as the other two can hold it, maybe we can still have some fun. It's important to carry every spare part you need. I didn't bring any spare engine mounts, unfortunately, so I didn't follow my rule. What I'm going to try to do this time is uh, throw it, but... Um, I think I'm going to remove this camera if I can't get it working. Okay, we got the red light on, so apparently it's filming. This time I'm going to throw the camera, I mean, uh, this time I'm going to throw the plane. Now it's important that you throw the plane with your left hand so that you can control the, uh, the elevator with your right hand. But um, that <coughs> the camera is right where I usually grip it, so it's kind of awkward. Okay, this could be a total disaster, but here goes.
here's how it is. Time, time to come back and uh, try another day. Things didn't quite work out for me today, but that's how it goes. You, you try, learn from your uh, failures, and then try again later.